God is mighty and does not he doesn't look down on anybody. But even if you're high and mighty amongst men, and you begin to slight God to make take the things of Him lightly, He will have the same attitude towards you. In fact, there are sometimes He said on that day, He said, "I've been knocking, you not you're not answering. I've been calling, you're not listening." He said, "The day your trouble will come, when you call, I will not I will not hear you." Did you read it in your Bible? Attitude. Garbage in, garbage out. You must take the, your meeting with God, your appointment with God is important. When you have an important appointment, it informs your dressing. True or false? I don't, some of the dresses I've seen in churches. All these shredded jeans. It doesn't matter. It doesn't nothing. It is, it doesn't matter. It's a spiritual thing. You, you look at their spirit, nothing day inside. Spirit, you know, qualify. Physical, you know. Where which one you day? Where are you? People we we are all kinds of things that leave nothing to the imagination. Even ladies and be shaking and coming to church. You talk to them, he said the taste of the spirit is the heart. I look at your heart, there is no, if your heart is right, your heart will drive your body. If you can wear that dress to meet the local government chairman, I'm not talking of the governor. You have no business wearing it to enter the house of God, the presence of God. Respect yourself. In Nigeria, it's easy to dress, it's cheap to dress. You can afford to dress. It doesn't have to be a, a costly attire. You can dress well. Honor God. Honor is the key. Honor is the key. Those that honor me, I will honor. Those that despise me will be lightly esteemed. Honor is the key. I too can we are we are we are we are box and come here and say it doesn't mean <laughs> it's of the spirit. It's in the spirit. It's not the, 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 it doesn't matter. It's in the heart. Which heart? That heart that is also in charge, devising evil against your neighbor. Some people, let's not deviate. So take it seriously. Don't be like some that make light of the appointment with God, their schedule with God. Hebrews 10 25 says we should not neglect the gathering of ourselves together, the coming together for service, as is the habit of some. He know God knows all his people. Make it a rendezvous with God and with fellow believers. The faithful in Christ. The house of God is not about the building. It's about the gathering together of God and his people. That's what constitutes the house of God. You can meet in the beach, you can meet in a house, you can be in a tent, you can be in a, in a, a big cathedral. But God and his people meet there. That's the house of God. We are the temple, dwelling place of the Holy Spirit. 